Uh, hello guys in this uh, video we are seeing uh, the greater number between two list two number the so to do so to determine that the greater number between two number so we need some conditional statements so in high level language like C C is not high level just mid level or that more high level languages advanced language uh, programming languages has uh, if else while loop and everything is inbuilt so you can just use if function uh, while function everything but in assembly language you don't have that you have to use some jumps conditional jumps to do so so let's have a look uh, here here is some conditional statements and that means uh, jg means jump if greater j and l means jump not less than or equal to so JGE means uh, jump if greater than and that's how there is many conditional statements if you just have a look at that I, I, I believe you'll be able to understand it what it's actually mean so oh, so I'm going to straight dive into the coding so let's have a look so let's say move BL so we're not taking uh, input here we're assigning a value like 9 and move l has uh, like a value of 6 right so now i'm going to compare which number is greater so to do so here as i told you that there is no if else what we can use so you have to use uh, a statement called CMP which means compare compare L into BL so we are comparing L with BL here where we can use conditional jump JG which means jump so I'm going to comment it jump if greater so Jodi so if AL is greater than BL then we're gonna say AL is greater if L is not greater than BL then we'll say BL is greater I hope you understand it, understood it if AL is greater than BL we're gonna jump into a level otherwise we're gonna say BL is greater than AL so Yeah. So, in conditional jump we're gonna use uh, level very often. So the way of declaring level is the name of the level and the same column. And that's how turn it. Okay. So let's see. We're gonna show some message that uh, wh which one is greater. Greater. Okay. So, okay not showing any message not uh, trying to complicate things uh, we are comparing two values uh, we the one is greater we're gonna print that and we will not print the other one so so here the condition comparing a and b if uh, l is uh, sorry uh, comparing a l and bl l is greater than bl then we're gonna jump into this level and print the value of l so okay so move a h to uh, move uh, moving the value of uh, L into DL and int 21H uh, otherwise if L is not greater than BL then we're gonna say BL is greater so then we're gonna print we're gonna print the BL so move uh, DL BL and 21H so let's see which one is greater right so you can see um, probably, uh, there is something wrong yes okay if uh, 
and uh, it's small in this case there is nine is greater so we're we into this level but some cases it uh, this digit is greater then we'll print this digit and then exit we are not going to execute this line so we gonna have to jump to exit exit this is the level we've been using this from the first video so so now I told you that you'll be able to understand each and everything with time so let me jump to exit so that these lines will not be executed okay so if you run it we run it again so we can see that uh, 9 is greater than 6 so that's why it's uh, uh, printing the 9 so if you just shuffle a little bit to change it you change it the first number bl to 6 and cl to 9 and I run it to print 9 this okay we use something else rather than 9 8 so yeah you can see that and showing and printing the larger number so that's how we use conditional jump statements if else work can be done by this jump statement so in the next few videos we're gonna explain about we're gonna use this a lot many and many more so goodbye guys